Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to ServiceNow 911 in the series of CMDB. Today we are discussing CMDB classification. If you are liking our video, just subscribe to the channel and in case you want to watch the videos in Hindi, you can go to this channel servicenowhelpdeskhindi.com. Okay? So let's go to the definition. What is CI classification? So it is nothing but the grouping of configuration items that is CI is that share similar attributes and are stored in a single table. Okay. So in order to make this arrangement uh, manageable in ServiceNow CMDB, we have created classes. You are already aware of the classes, right? So what are these classes? These classes are nothing but a way to classify and and these are the separate tables which store similar CIs which share similar attributes. Each and every class is a separate table. Let me open one of it. You see here CMDB CI is open, but when I open AI server, it redirects us to this table that is CMDB underscore CI underscore AIX underscore servers. Okay, so that's what uh, we were talking about separate table for each class. So a CI class can be independent as well as it can be a dependent CI. Okay, so it depends on the nature and the architecture of that particular CI class. In case of independent class, the CI does not uh, depends on any other CI. Okay, it generally exists by its own. So, for example, you see server CI, whereas opposite to it, there are dependent CIs. And in case of server CI, there are some applications which are hosted on that particular server, right? So these applications are dependent CIs and it depends on the nature on the a status of the server is the server is not working then obviously uh, the application which is hosted on that server will not work so it is a kind of dependency we can see here so they have provided some more examples such as network adapters so these network adapters are fixed on a particular hardware so if the hardware is not working or if the hardware CI is no more than in that case uh, the network adapter will be affected okay so this is what we call uh, CMDB classification and dependency between the classes. In next videos, we will discuss about how to make these dependencies like uh, how to create identification rules and all. Okay, so stay tuned, uh, subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much. Bye bye.